like I'm in a storybook. Oh, it's bliss. I dream that it would be somewhat, but not like this. Hey everyone, I hope you're doing awesome, and I hope everyone that I tag, because there's like 20 million of you, <laughs> that you're all working on your five facts. I did my five facts the other day, um, I was tagged by Joey, and I tagged like 20 people, like I said, and I'm sorry about that, because I didn't think about it um, long enough, and it <laughs> I just was thinking five people, five facts, five people, you have to fa tag five people. So, sorry about that, I really didn't mean to. As for the t-shirts, yeah. I started a thread on the like official college program Facebook group. Things got a little crazy in there. I don't know what happened. I started a new one. Um, Joanna kindly deleted the other thread for me and uh, now the new one is up. Um, but I did count all the votes that were in the other thread, so all of those votes are still being counted. Just check that out, because I explained it there. Yeah, I'm really excited because I really do want um, us to order the shirt, whatever wins, because I think it would be so awesome for us to all have something that represents our program together. And some people are like being all negative Joey <laughs> I'm just kidding we are gonna do it don't think we aren't um, because even if however we have like 400 members of on that group even if only like the vloggers and like a few other people order them whatever like we'll still have awesome t-shirts I think it's worth it definitely Registration for my school for classes for the fall semester are coming up kind of quick, and uh, I've been having to try and figure out like what I want to do. Um, I want to stay full time because I need to keep my insurance. <laughs> God forbid anything actually happened to me when I was down there. So. Um, I've been looking at all the classes that like Disney offers and uh, all the online classes that Marywood has and I think I'm going to take a religion class and possibly a psychology class online and then I've been looking at the Disney classes which look really cool. Um, the three I was thinking of were experiential learning, creativity and innovation, and marketing you. But the only one that fits into my curriculum is creativity and innovation. So I still have to figure out how that works out. I don't know. I'm really excited to take them either way. I don't know how many I'll be taking, I don't know if I'll only take one or if I'll try and take two, but it's going to be hard, I know it is, because we're literally working full time, and I'd be a full time student. I don't know how it's going to happen, but it has to, because otherwise, if something happens, I'm screwed. I also found out today that I'm actually gonna, going to get credit for the college program which is so cool because I really didn't think I was going to at all um, but for my major for illustration we have to do like probably like everyone else's major you have to do field work experience so it's counting for my field work experience like three credits whoa I didn't even expect it I'm really happy because it kind of felt like well, I can breathe now because I really didn't think I was going to be able to figure all this out. But it's coming together, slowly but surely. But yeah, thanks Marywood for giving me credit for going to Disney World. Yay. <laughs> Recently, we just kind of sealed the apartment mate deal, which is so awesome, so cool. Um, Emily finally found a roommate, which is awesome. I'm so excited to talk to Kate 
that's her name. <laughs> and so let's see, we have me, Amanda Russell, Jessica, and her friend Amanda, Emily, and her newfound roommate Kate. I think we're going to get along so well. Um, we, have, well, I guess we want a four bedroom at Patterson, but we don't know if they exist. So, we got to find that out because we could get two more in and Amanda Russell knows of a person that might want that, which would be so cool. So, if you are on the CP or you've done it before and you know for sure, either way, that there is or there is not four bedroom apartments at Patterson, will you let me know? Because we're trying to figure that out and I can't find it anywhere and I could have swore I saw it somewhere but I can't find it now. So, please let me know. You will be my hero of the week. So, I wanted to get back into asking questions this week. So, my question this week is, what is your strangest or weirdest, I guess, maybe funniest hobby or um, pastime that you have? My answer to this question would be mullet hunting. Um, but th it also kind of ties with getting into pictures that, of, that people are taking that I don't know. So like, say I'm walking past this like statue or so, something and someone is taking a picture of their friends and I just happen to walk by and make some funny gesture and get myself in the picture. Maybe. I especially love doing it in Disney World because um, there's a lot of picture taking there obviously and there's so many people that they don't even realize I'm like sneaking up behind them. So yeah, prepare yourself for that if you're gonna hang out with me in Disney, you might just want to see that coming, <laughs> okay? As for mullet hunting, um, I'm an avid mullet hunter. Uh, I found a great mullet in Disney World on my last trip, actually. I'm going to post it in this video right now. Yeah. That's a pretty good mullet. Um, bleached out, blonde, rocking it out pretty good. Yeah, pretty good mullet. Good finding on my part. That mullet was found in the depths of <laughs> the All-Star Movies Resort. I guess, really, my two combined mullet hunting and creeping into pictures I guess I just like being a creeper. I guess it's a bad thing. Maybe I should change hobbies. Maybe. So, that's all for right now. I will probably make another video soon. And I hope you guys have a great week. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye. No. No, no, no. Have a magical day.